Derek Young of K-State Online. You're a Cherry Creek High School tight end, Gunner Helm, much taller than me, of course. What is actually your size right now? Uh, I'm 6'5", two, 225, so I'm trying to get to 235 before the season starts. Okay, and then we'll we'll talk about that. You're headed into your final season. You just got done with basketball. What are the besides adding you know ten pounds of probably muscle? What are what are some things you want to get better at in between that time frame? Well, I definitely want to try to perfect my craft. Uh, I want to work on my route running, trying to become an even better blocker. Um, try to pride myself on that as much as I can. So I always think there's room for improvement for blocking. So um, you know, definitely definitely uh, working on the right steps to take and uh, route running for the season. Okay, that's great. And of course, uh, you're recruited by Colin Klein. He recruits the state of Colorado quite a bit, even though he's the quarterback coach. What is your relationship with him? I'm sure he's probably been in the school for eight years now. You know, first intentions, I was like, this dude's this dude's awesome. He's, he's so cool. He's, he's a young dude. So I mean, I vibe, I vibe with him pretty well. And, um, you know, I'm, I'm excited to keep building the relationship. A question I have, and I'm always not very sure of Colin Klein, of course, was a, a, a you know, a runner-up for a Heisman Trophy at one point when, during his playing career at Kansas State. Does that still resonate with recruits? I mean, yeah, for sure. I mean, it, it shows that he knows what he's doing with the quarterback position, and, um, you know, it, it shows that you can trust him to be your coach. And, I mean, I think that goes such a long way. Tight end coach is Courtney Messingham. He's also the offensive coordinator. What's your, been your interaction like with him so far, if at all? Well, he was actually the first person I met with from K-State. Um, I met with him. Uh, he said it, he wanted to get me to 250, and first thought I was like, "Wow, I mean, I don't, I don't know if I want to go above 250, but um, you know, we'll see, we'll see where it goes." I mean, I loved him; he is, he's a great guy. So, and you're planning to visit K State, right? Yes, sir. Yeah, sometime in the, in April or late March. So, I asked Miles this, but K State's offered all three of you: you, Miles, and of course Arden Walker. Sure. Does that help a school at all when they're putting, you know, interest in all three of you at the same time? I think it does. You know, we have a lot of uh, chemistry just between us three. I mean. Um, I mean, we've been here for three years, we're good friends, close friends, played basketball together. So, you know, I definitely think it's important to, you know, offer teammates if you offer one, I'm, because, you know, the chemistry is just there and, you know, you just have to trust. How strong is the temptation for you all three to go to the same school? We'll see. Um, it's it's going gonna, it's gonna to take some time to decide, but, um, you know, I, I definitely think it could be there at the end. When deciding on your school that you will eventually commit to, sign to, what are two or three big things that you're going to focus on? Uh, I want to make sure I get a good ed education. Uh, I want a really good game day atmosphere, and uh, I want to feel at home and uh, love the coaching staff. Are those some of the things you'll be looking for when you visit Manhattan in either March or April? Yes, sir. Yeah, for sure. Okay, and then one of the questions is a tough one. Obviously, you have a ton of schools after you, uh, a ton of offers as well. Is there any you can say that are actually standing out or that you maybe are in contact with the most right now? Um, one of the schools I'm with contact the most right now is Kansas State, actually. Um, you know, they definitely stand out. Uh, Auburn definitely stands out. Um, Wisconsin standing out, Tennessee, uh, Nebraska for sure. Um, I mean, yeah, we'll just see. We'll see how the spring goes. But. And you plan on visiting most of those or all of them? Yes, sir. Yeah, I am. Okay. Is that going to be a busy spring or busy yeah, summer? It should, be, it should be a pretty busy spring and summer. Okay. And then if you were to, uh, I guess, pl play any other position besides tight end, I know you're not going to. It's just an inter interesting question. What would it be? Well, I mean, I played wide out my whole life. You know, I, this is the first year I actually played tight end. So, I mean, I put on 45 pounds in one off season. To try to, to just try to get ready for the position, but uh, yeah, I mean, I play wide out again. Have you put on most of the, the recent weight, like really recent? Have you, did you spike in weight quite a bit in the past year? Yeah, actually, I, I mean, I was 185 at the end of last season, and I, I went into this season at 225. So okay, that's a pretty good, pretty good growth spurt. Yes, this sir. is Gunnar Hell, one of the best tight ends in the country. I'm Derek Young with K State Online.